Hey guys, and welcome to the channel. My name is Elizabeth, and today we're going to be talking about the low moments can make you stronger if you let it. And so I don't know if these videos are helpful for you. I know I do financial education videos or like tactics. Hey, do these seven things. This will help you. But sometimes I just share what's on my heart or something that I feel like people might need to hear or that I need to hear. And so let me know in the comments below if this is helpful, but let's go ahead and get into the message. So if you have a hard time, if you have a low moment, it's natural. It's part of it, right? Like even if you have one moment in a day, it's just part of the day. It's just a moment, right? And so I want you to give yourself permission to say that's part of life. A lot of people are so worried about feeling a negative feeling or having a negative thought or having something hard happen or a mistake or you get embarrassed, but that's part of life and that's okay. And so if you're trying to achieve a goal, if you're trying to build wealth for yourself, if you're just trying to go through your every day, like give yourself grace and say, it's normal. Let Tell yourself you're normal. So I'm here to tell you guys and to help you guys hopefully have a happier and healthier life. But it's not just about being happy all the time, right? We have all of these different emotions that we get to feel and experience. And sometimes we're tired, but we did something fun, but then we got tired after it or someone passed away. And so we get sad or, um, if you're a female, it's your time of the month, whatever, right? You're going to go through these different phases of life and that's the beauty of life. And so don't get so upset. Like it's okay to feel sad. It's okay to feel mad. It's okay to feel tired. Of course, we want to feel excited. We want to feel in love. We want to feel excited and happy and purposeful, right? And so, yes, I'm here to show you and tell you how we can do that more and to help reduce the suffering that we feel. But I also want to give you permission that it's okay to feel sad sometimes or it's okay to have a hard moment. And then to empower you and say, hey, if you had a hard moment, use that as a learning opportunity. Use that as perspective and to say, whoa, I'm so grateful my car is always working or usually works. And because getting that flat tire or then it had to go in the shop for a whole month or whatever, that was hard. And so I'm really grateful that typically my car works or you were scared like that a loved one had to go to the hospital and then they ended up being okay. And you, maybe if you were going to get in an argument with them, or if you're having a hard time with them, you just like, you just see them differently. And you're like, wow, I'm just grateful you're here. And so you have different perspective, right? And so life is about lessons and everyday moments give you lessons and serving people and helping people. And so I just want to encourage you, if you have a hard moment, um, make you, make it help you use it as a lesson, use it as perspective and to see, wow, I am so grateful for who I have in my life or for what I have in my life. I can still keep working on my goals. I can still keep doing things, but help it to help you appreciate and have more gratitude because gratitude can go a long way and use it. If you have a hard moment or you make a mistake or you're not prepared for a meeting or you get pulled over and you don't have your driver's license, like use that as a moment to go, Ooh, I need to get prepared. I need to go make sure I get my license. I need to have my wallet. I need to do all this stuff. And so just use that to help you become better, right? Help it to become better and to appreciate the person and the people in your life. So I hope this message was helpful for you. I just wanted to give you encouragement um, because I know that so many people I talk to and everyone, like as a human, you just experience these moments and it's okay. I want to give you permission. It's okay. Now, if you feel horrible all the time, then that's definitely something you need to address and talk to your doctor about. But if you like, is it appropriate? Did your dog just pass away and you're kind of sad? Like that's appropriate. It's an appropriate feeling and that might not be fun, but that's a part of life. Are you stressed out because you just ran all the way over there and then this person did this and this person needed this and then you had to go do all these chores and whatever? Like, yeah, okay. So figure out what you can do and put into your life to help deal with it. And that's where I'm about adding those daily vitamins in, making sure you're exercising, making sure you're organized and prepared and you have your plan and your schedule so that you're able to deal with things more easily. But it doesn't mean that you're just gonna be perfectly hunky dory and happy all the time. And that's okay. It doesn't mean anything's wrong with you. It actually means something's right with you and you are experiencing life. And what a beautiful gift it is to be able to experience that, to experience all the emotions and all the feelings and all of the beauties and the intricacies of life. So thanks so much for being here. I hope you enjoyed this message. Let me know if these messages are helpful to you. Um, I like doing them every once in a while. And I hope that it can resonate with another person. So thanks so much. You've got this. Feel free to like and subscribe for more. And I will see you in the next video. Bye guys. Enjoy the journey. Enjoy the feelings. It's okay. It's normal. You're normal. And let's figure out how to make more good ones and put more light and goodness into the world. Bye guys.